a horizontal venturi meter with inlet and throat diameters 40 cm and 20 cm respectively is used to measure the flow of water the reading of differential manometer connected to the inlet and throat is 18 cm of mercury determine the rate of flow of water take cd is equals to 0.97 here cd means coefficient of discharge so here we are using horizontal venturi meter and inlet diameter so first of all let us note down the given data inlet diameter inlet diameter d1 is equals to 40 centimeters and throat diameter throat diameter d2 is equals to 20 centimeters okay next the flow of water and the reading of differential manometer connected to the inlet and throat is 18 centimeter of water so reading of uh, reading of differential manometer okay reading of differential manometer is given so reading of a differential manometer generally denoted by x so given x value x is equals to 18 centimeter of mercury okay so we are using heavy liquid as a mercury and specific gravity of mercury is 13.6 so here we are measuring uh, rate of flow of water so density of uh, i mean specific gravity of water is 1 so next we given uh, coefficient of discharge cd so coefficient of discharge how much 0 0.97 at last we need uh, rate of flow rate of flow so rate of flow measured by venturi meter is given by cd into a1 a2 root over 2gh whole divided by root over a1 square minus a2 square a1 square minus a2 square so discharge measured by venturi meter is given by cd into a1 into a2 root over 2gh by root over a1 square minus a2 square so this discharge q's discharge and okay fine so here uh, cd value is there and what about a1 and a2 so what is mean by a1 and what is mean by a2 let us see what is a1 and a2 here a1 means inlet area inlet area or area at inlet so inlet area formula pi by 4 into for circular cross, cross section pi by 4 into d1 square so pi by 4 into d1 so what is the value of d1 diameter inlet diameter is 40 centimeters so 40 whole square now a1 is equals to pi by 4 into 40 whole square means 1600 four ones four hundreds you will get 400 pi units square centimeters now what about a2 a2 means throat area throat area so for throat area what is the formula pi by 4 into d2 whole square okay now so pi by 4 d2 how much here d2 is 20 centimeters so 20 whole square so let us calculate further now a2 is equals to pi by 4 20 whole square means 400 4 ones are and 400 you will get 100 pi centimeters square or square centimeters and still what is the unknown in this formula we need rate of flow q we have to find discharge cd is given a1 a2 already calculated g is acceleration due to gravity and what about h h means difference of pressure head okay here h means difference of Present head. 
So how do we get difference of president? What is the formula for H? H is equals to X into SHG by SW minus 1. Okay. Here, uh, anyhow, we are using heavier liquid than uh, uh, the working fluid. So, anyhow, H is equals to X. X how much? 18 centimeters. So, 18 into SHG. Specific gravity of mercury 13.6. Specific gravity of water 1 minus 1. Now, H is equals to 18 into 13.6 minus 1. How much? 12.6. So 18 into 12.6. If you calculate, you will get H value. H is equals to. So 18 into 13.6. I mean 18 into 12.6. Not 13.6. 12.6. So 18 into 12.6. How much? 226.8 centimeters. Okay, na. So difference of pressure head is 226.8 centimeters. Okay. Let us substitute all values uh, in this formula in discharge. Okay. So let us uh, substitute all values then we can find Q. Now what about G? G means acceleration due to gravity. Its standard value is 9.81 meter per second square. But so here uh, we consider areas and uh, and uh, difference of pressure head in centimeters so we have to convert uh, acceleration due to gravity in centimeters so we know that uh, 1 meter per second square is equal to 100 centimeters per second square so you will get uh, g is equals to 981 centimeter per second square okay so let us substitute all values now Q is equals to rate of flow. CD how much? 0 0.97 into A1. A1 value 400 pi centimeter square into A2. A2 how much? 100 pi into root over 2 into 981 into H 226.8 whole divided by root over a1 square minus a2 square so it means 400 pi whole square minus 100 pi whole square so now using scientific calculator we can find a value of uh, numerator and denominator okay so first of all uh, 0 0.97 into 400 into 100 it can be written as 4 into how many zeros? 1, 2, 3, 4. So 10 power 4. Pi into pi? Pi square. Into root over 2 into 981. 1962 into 226.8. Whole divided by root over. If you find the value of 400 pi whole square minus 100 pi whole square, you will get approximately 1480 double four zero point six six okay let us uh, calculate further so q is equal to if you find the value of numerator you will get around two double five double four seven double nine four point six one whole divided by root over this value square root value use scientific calculator okay now it's very easy to uh, find uh, the square root value using scientific calculator. Okay. No? If you if you uh, perform this operation using scientific calculator, you will get uh, around one two one six point seven. Okay. No? Now, so what is the value of Q now? Q is equal to so final value you will get around 209946.33 centimeter cube per second okay centimeter cube per second so but we suppose uh, we need answer in liters per second we know that 1 liter is equals to 1000 centimeter cube per second so now q 
क्यू इज इक्वल टू टू जीरो नाइन नाइन फोर सिक्स पॉइंट थ्री थ्री सो मल्टीप्लाई एंड डिवाइड बाई थाउजेंड सेंटीमीटर क्यू पर सेकेंड नाउ क्यू इज इक्वल्स टू सो थाउजेंड सेंटीमीटर क्यू पर सेकेंड मीन्स वन लीटर पर सेकेंड सो टू जीरो नाइन नाइन फोर सिक्स पॉइंट थ्री थ्री डिवाइड बाई थाउजेंड मीन्स यू विल गेट टू जीरो नाइन पॉइंट अप्रॉक्सिमेटली कैन राइट नाइन फाइव ओके देर फोर रेट ऑफ फ्लो ऑफ वाटर इन हॉर्जेंटल वेंचुरी मीटर इज टू जीरो नाइन पॉइंट नाइन फाइव लीटर्स पर सेकेंड दिस इज द फाइनल आंसर